All my life, in all my days, the joy of my heart to give a rest of all I praise. You don't know this is I chess in the camera say, don't sing clear, reggae vibes. Keep it flowing. Big up and roll the code, they can't fool with. Welcome, welcome, welcome people, all YouTubers, to another Dancing Clear Reggae Vibes Quick Fire interview. Go and big up yourself, Dancing Clear, and big up yourself, and Rudy Cooley. But people, who we have here? None other than the golden vocals of one of Jamaica's great reggae singers, the one and only Mr. Chesley. Boom. Where are you going? Respect. Man. Yes, sir. Yes, I. Yes, I. Yes, I. So, like I said, Reggie, we're going to do a quick fire interview. I was going to fling some questions in your direction, okay? So, Chizzy, here we go. What age did you get into the music and what inspired you? Well, I don't know the music you've done in Abbey, so I was never even really getting at it. Still. But <laughs> music business now, we're getting at it. Maybe. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Maybe 20 something. But we know the music long time and the music in our family ever since, you know? Okay. Yeah. Okay, tell me something. Did you ever buy music before? Buy? Yeah. Yeah, we used to buy vinyl one long time ago. Okay, so what, so what was your first record you ever bought? You can no, remember? No, 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 no. no, no. Okay. But, but my version, my cousin is talking about the song, so I'm going to tell you buy to work hard. Okay. Give them the thing you want. So tell me, do you, do you have a, like a, um, a favourite artist or album that you listen to more than that, that you always well, go back to? I <coughs> listen to the old school 70s, 80s, 70s, 60s, 80s artists, them like D. Brown, them, Mugu, Graham, and John, and them, and them, big singer, them, they were big singer, them, and okay. you know, we just sang with them, and the Baba, and them, and all of them, big singer. Yeah, man, we listen to sing at them, and love the music. That's a good thing about love, you know, so. Mm. Nice. So tell me something, brother. Um, what's one of your best moments in, in, in the industry, best show or something like this? Well, the shows don't keep getting better and better, and so we haven't even reached the best one yet. But <laughs> <laughs> some great things happen, man, you know, keep going on. Life is good, man. Okay. So that's sad. Alright. Yeah. So, could, they, could, 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 could the public compare you to anybody? Who would you say you're most like? Or, or is it? No, well, when the team. public want to compare me, I got for their business, but me and I don't compare myself, which I don't want to you know what I'm saying? Because I mean, get inspiration from most artists that before me, you know? Yeah. The great ones before me, get inspiration mm -hmm. from them. Yeah, I'm motivated by the, them songs too, you know? As an artist and their story and their history. Okay. You know what I mean? And mm -hmm. I love the ones, the artists, them were good currently. and. We know some great artists yet to come to, so mm -hmm. you know, we just uh, play a little part and go and sing a little song. Mm -hmm. And there's nothing I can say when no one never said before. The only difference is a little different melody and a little different style, you know, so I okay. don't think it's fair for me to compare. Mm -hmm. It's the last thing I share, you know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's <cheer. Yeah. laughs> So tell me something, have you, is, have you always um, just done music or did you did you work anywhere, you, you, you a profession or anything like this? Uh, well, professional, I never really work anywhere no, still. I just have school, a little experience thing and then I never have it when I was born sing. But I plant food and farm still. But okay. plant ganja and sell it. Uh, Sometimes I got my yes. broke, you know? Mm -hmm. So, yeah, but music is a real thing, you know? Okay. I, I believe it. Mm -hmm. Like singers, isn't it? Mm -hmm. But we are farmers, we plan of things. All right. Yeah, we are poor. So, Chesley, what are you doing? We are going good, man. We love to take land for both and grow in the musical. Mm -hmm. you know, even myself, I've seen where I am improving. Yeah. So, a good thing, everything happened the way we done. Mm -hmm. uh, so, we are there a long time and we stay there, fresh, same way. So, out of all your songs, I know you've got a multitude of songs. See. Okay. Which is what me? Which ones mean the most to you? Do you have like you got a favorite song out of all the songs you've done, or a top five? All my life is like a that? real big song where it really means a lot to me. All my life. Yeah. And then I leave the cheese was a song where mm. open the door like. True, true, true. And then there's a lot of great songs still, huh? But 
some greater songs not come yet. Mm-hmm. See it? But right now, man, some songs are going to sing it. So, listen up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, um, listen to the other types of music, every genres of music? Yeah, man, but I'm also listening to the 70s, 60s, 70s, okay. 80s era, mostly. But I can appreciate every type of music, every genre, every time. Mm-hmm. But most of that time, the time, the era of reggae music, I'm listening. <coughs> Most likely, I could have a lot of vibes. And you know, sometimes I listen to certain. I listen to certain artists, certain DJ to sometimes. Certain. Yeah. yeah. Certain. Can I name them? Certain ones where you take to your heart more than others? I don't say take to my heart. But more time, you know, you know, say, yeah, that's something bad. I like to like Bujo, you know, Bujo. Because oh, yeah. I want to listen to some Bujo sometimes. Like if, <coughs> you know. Yeah, man, enough I DJ them, man. Certain song. Yeah. Like some of them, I don't remember the name, but they have a one song with BUD! And most of them in a different mood and all them songs, they fill in the space. You know? but most of the time, like when me ever play music, if you listen to me, I'm going to play. And I hear all their music. You know? mm-hmm. But we respect it, most of the artists, them, man. the current artists, them, man. but you know, we get my inspiration from that. He ready. Okay. Straight up. So if you could make any changes in this music industry? Do you know what? Would you change anything about the industry or the industry? You see it cool as it is, or yeah, well, it's changes? cool as it is, man. If I go on industry, I go on good, man. Yeah, trust me. Yeah, man. Yeah. You them will come positive again. So, so you, you them will come with more positive energy again. Yeah. So that's a good thing, and you know. By the time the standard is dropped, but it's a build up back, and these things are just some cycles. And, Mm-hmm. You know, so. Yeah, man, we give thanks for how it is and how it has been, and looking forward to how it will be. Alright. Mm-hmm. So tell me something. If you could build a band right now and put certain musicians in your band, past and present, or present, I should say, um, who would your band consist of? Like musicians? Yeah. No, if I build a band, I'd be a young youth, no, a new youth, man. Yeah. Be a new young youth, man, we're going to my band, man. See. I make them just go with the music and just know, say, oh, my plate says let the like music and play it right, and then, you know. Mm-hmm. Like, I like the youth, them, I like work with the youth, them, the youth musician, them. Okay. Yeah, because they're more open and more flexible. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah, but if I make music now, I know, so like if I make this song, I know this drum or this bass or this whoever will fit perfectly playing this song mm-hmm. or this other song, you know, say, that man they right, that guitarist they have to play, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. But like if I have a creator or something new, you know, like my band now, you know, say, my local musician, then. yeah, man, we have to just come pick some youth where we can hear the t- talk, we can identify the real talent in them. Yeah. From you know, just listening to them and just like other people could listen to Chesley like when we were young and say, yeah, something like that. Mm-hmm. So we were like choose our musician and them. You know what I mean? And then bring them in up the, the the right just way. Yeah. Respect. Yeah. Okay, so Chesley. All I wanna say is on behalf of Don Sinclair Reggae Vibes, I just wanna say thank you very much for passing yeah. through and giving us this Quick fire interview, so manners and respect. Blessed old man, dancing everywhere, yeah, yeah, there and everywhere. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> so, so people, Boom. you hear from the man himself, Mr. Leave the Trees, mm-hmm. Chesy Dick, mm-hmm. see, coming to you live and direct. Mm-hmm. Well, big up yourself, Dancing Clear, and big up yourself, I'm really calling. This has been another YouTube Dancing Clear, Dancing Clear Quick Fire interview. Blessed love. Boom. Yeah, I remember to check out the album, Irie Day, new album, just released. Bye. Hear that? <laughs> Boom. Wow. Yeah.